Fair. Okay. Fair. Nick is. Is it, is it recording? Dude, Nick is so nervous. This is hilarious. Uh, this is, I don't know how to. What the f is going on? <laughs> Bro, Dude, it's weird to like talk about your relationship on like. Online. Yeah, but like you, it's, you can't avoid it now because you've already talked so much. You guys obviously it's aware. I Everyone's mean, aware. Didn't want to do it, but she had to drop like a thing that. A TikTok? Big, yeah. Yeah, so listen, he comes to the gym and he's like telling me, he's like, yo, did you see this? I'm like, what the f And so why like what what's going on actually because like i don't really know the true story i don't really know everything there's obviously a lot more than just that video yeah okay well people i feel like people started speculating before we even like actually broke up yeah so you guys right now are on. broken up yeah oh sh yeah this is so weird it's so weird bro i've I, talked I, about I, a lot of things on the internet but i've not had to talk about like a relationship it's weird when like it's this. just like it's too real man well have you ever you've never really put a relationship on the internet before no that, never yeah so like i think the best thing to do is to talk because otherwise like people just go oh f this guy f that girl blah 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 this is why and they just speculate make it up instead right, of yeah. just like just letting people know what it is you know yeah right. maybe it is a good idea because i'm getting like Every comment on the YouTube video, what happened with you and Sky? And my DMs yeah. are that, everything. Our and Discord. people, because because you guys are willing to put your relationship out there, like they get invested in like whether it's good or bad or it's still there or not, you know? Right. So if you just disappear, everyone's like, well, everyone's going to be like, well, what the fuck happened? Yeah. So it's like addressing yeah. it, I think is always a good idea. So what, so what, why, why did you post a TikTok? Why are you saying that? I didn't post a TikTok. So I was live on TikTok and someone, they just started asking like, are you still with Nick? And I said, no, we broke up. And they were like asking what happened, obviously. And I just said, I don't know, go ask him. There but were just some happened? differences. There were differences. Yeah, well, tell us what actually happened. If you had to guess what happened, what would you think? Okay. <laughs> God, <I laughs> what like do you think Brad, the what, issue what you, is? What do you think, Brad? Well, <laughs> okay. My expert opinion. <laughs> um, obviously... You know, you you do a certain kind of work. Uh, I'd imagine that, and I don't know enough about this. This is the first time I'm talking about this. I imagine that it probably got to him at some. It got to him too much to where he's like, ah, I don't know if whatever. Wow, you nailed it. That was exactly it. But like, <laughs> okay, that's not all of it. There's got to be more. There's two sides. Yeah, there's two. There's definitely two sides. But so so what's 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 different or what's new that is like. Cause like, it wasn't like that in the beginning. You guys knew what yeah. it was. You both knew what it was. You both knew where you came from. I think that he acted chill in the beginning. Which <laughs> <laughs> he fished you. Well, that's how I feel like a lot of guys are in the beginning of relationships. Like they're like easy going, but then once the feelings start to like get deeper and you get like more involved with someone then like, and you're like actually in love with them, then stuff like gets to them easy. And then he started yeah, I can admit, like, on my side, I think as things grew and, you know, I fell in love and some things I think, like, did make me go, like, a little off the wall. Like, yeah. it would bother me. Things, And I had to really tell myself, like, I knew what I got myself into. I shouldn't be bothered by that. But I think that's not, like, that's not everything. It's... And then he started accusing me of cheating on him. This no, I did that. not accuse you of cheating on me. I just like would like, you know, sometimes you would wonder like, no, I'm guy. traveling. She's doing her thing. Like you don't like there's and seeing everything online. It's like sometimes it is hard, but I think like. Is it things that you're seeing like she's posting or things that people are saying or like, what is the thing that's making you think that? I think like, I'm just going to be real. Like her Twitter, it's almost like. And I get tagged in a lot of things. And when you're seeing like, oh, this is coming out and this is coming, I'm like, what the f is going on? Like, yeah. that makes me tweak out a little bit. Cause like, I can accept the only fans. I'm cool with the only fans, but I'm like, I thought we put, I thought we put that in the past. I think she's so much better than that. She, she's an incredible girl. She's so smart, sweet. She, she was like my rock. She's amazing. Um, it was. It sounds such a right, fun. That it's hurt. so that that That's fed up. And, uh, and now he's you know, bullshit. He never even liked OnlyFans. He hates OnlyFans. He okay. says it all the time. I'm like, I wish you it. didn't have to do this. Like, had issues with me even just doing, like, solo content. Okay. Yeah. Solo, like, what is, what's, so solo content is just like. Like, I go live, like, once a week uh, for an hour, and they, like, tip. And the more they tip, the more I do. Mm. And, like, I would tell him, like, babe, I have to go live today. And he would be, like, <sighs> it's hard. moping around. Okay. Like, Damn. <laughs> But you knew what it was. I know. It's so what 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 do you I think? think? It's tough for me knowing that all these other dudes 
Yeah. We're watching that. And that's yeah. hard. Like for me, the kind of guy I am, I'm a very one-on-one kind of person, sexually in a relationship, all of that. Like I'm very one-on-one. So about how I was raised, how I've been. Just, I can't, it's hard. That's hard. To, but you knew that. I know. That's yes. the thing. You knew it. It's going tough, man. It. I'm battling, bro. And that's my, why my feelings are hurt. Because yeah. he knew what it was when he started dating me. And I didn't do anything. I was loyal our whole relationship. I was too. Yeah, I know. But um, so it's like hurtful to me because it's like I was good. Like I did everything I was supposed to. I was a good girlfriend. But still like I'm the one that like the relationship ended because of me. Because you like couldn't handle seeing the and stuff. Is that is that really just it? <sighs> I mean, I think there's a little bit more. I think, okay, I think looking back, I should have been more chill out about the solo shit. She's not with other dudes. Yeah. She's doing her thing. She 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 probably went from here to here for me, getting rid of all that. I was probably here and went to here. So she gave up a lot yeah, I more. I, 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 I can agree with that. Um, and I think, you know, I did let it get to my head a little bit. But there are things that I need to do on my platform that kind of like I want to do that I think is good for my content and there's like, like talking what? with like girls, like flirting with girls and, and nothing more than that. It, you know, I think going out, but with- he wanted to flirt with girls on his <laughs> YouTube before we even broke up. So it's like, I had to stop doing own like, porn, she's but t- you but can she's be out here me- actually talking okay, okay. and flirting with girls. Okay. Okay. But she's telling me that she wants to use old boy, girl content and, and put that out as new boy, girl content. I'm like, no, just we like were... re-releasing stuff that hadn't but, ever but been, but it's released. being branded as new. I thought we're over well, that. Well, it is new, but like that new, new. What does that mean? That's like, like it's, I have content that I filmed, but I just never released. But so I, like, over time I slowly release it. So it is new. Like in my head, I'm like, we're over that. It's done. Like this is, that should be in the, <laughs> Yo, that but, should be in the, okay. was that, hold on, hold on. I have genuine, genuine question. Was that, that conversation before you broke up or after you broke up? Um, I think that's like kind of what made us go our separate ways. Yeah, the whole yeah. thing is that like here. Was the, this I is the thing like that I'll just tell you. It's we're both in our twenties. She's created a whole brand for herself. She's done it. I have an opportunity to to do something. There's things I feel like we both feel like we got to do. Yeah, and it came to the point where we couldn't compromise for each other. So I feel like you know I have to go out with my guys and do what we got to do. Like to talking to girl both. It's, and it's, it's so nothing. So it's just like. Bullshit. Yeah, does it's, that, it's does funny. That bu- it's does funny. That bug you? It's so. It's just comedy. I mean, he like gets upset. He got upset sometimes when I went on even e dates, which is like virtual. Okay, I will admit that that was. But that's because I wasn't allowed. Every time but, but, he hold, was no, upset. No, but here's the thing. She told me before, you can't go do girls. So I don't want you doing girl stuff. So when I see her doing stuff, floating with other guys, I'm like, okay, you're telling me not to do girl stuff. I'm gonna have an <laughs> issue too. Eventually, I did say that. Do what you have to do. Like she, but she, think, she claims she claims I'm, it's different. I'm the princess. Like I'm like what? Hell no! Like if you're, <laughs> yeah, if you're okay. making a rule for me, it's gonna go both ways. Like that's the truth. I'm sorry. Why is that funny? I don't know. Why? Because I think it's- I was getting too personal. Huh? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay, but I, I gotta ask this. Serious. I'm. So you guys were together, and you were like, "Yo, I'm gonna release some old stuff, but it's new." Yeah. What's wrong with that? Oh. Um, okay. I'm going to tell you my perspective on that, okay? Because to everyone on the internet, it's brand new. Yeah. So to everyone on the internet- I look like an idiot. To everyone on the internet, after the time when you guys were like, yo, I'm not doing this, I'm giving up that, like that boy-girl thing, you're now just kind of doing it all over again to everyone. So perspective-wise, like if, if you're an audience person, you're someone watching this, when they see that, they go, this is brand new. And then immediately they go, she's having sex with dudes on camera again. What the fuck are you doing, Nick? Right. And he'll, he would never be able to avoid that. And I'm not saying this is like a, you know, this is to each their own to decide whether they want to deal with that or not. But like, that's that goes directly against, I think, the conversations. I think I wasn't part of some conversations about that in the past. Like, why, you know, like you were giving that up. Mm-hmm. And so you got to some point where you were like, well, I'm not going to give that up essentially again, where you came back to it for some reason. I think it was just, I, I don't really look at it like that because it's not stuff that I ever filmed while we were dating or like it's stuff yeah. that I filmed before I even like met him. I so it. it's like it's already I already made the content. And also, OK, the big. But for you, me, you, I still have to make money like of course. I'm in my early 20s. I'm 
branded for life. Like he, his thing is like, you could do other things, which I do uh, do other things. I do Twitch, but he's like, you can make money other ways. Like blah, blah, blah. But it's like, I am so heavily branded as a star. And like, I always will be like, if we're being honest, like that's yeah. something that like people do not lose. Like if you do like, that's like what you're going to be associated with. So it's like, I can't, I don't have all these other like ways I can like make money and stuff. So it's like essentially I kind of started to feel like resentment towards him because I felt like he was like s limiting me from like making money. Yeah. You but know? you don't think there's other ways you can make money? Like, I mean, there's tons I mean, of there's, brands and shit that'll still work with you. It's hard. Harder. It's really, really hard. Yeah. yeah. So there's no outside sources of income other than just like, the no, OS? there are, there yeah. are, but it's like only the bag is just so good. I know. And I enjoy doing, like, I enjoy running my only, friends. like, it's really fun. But he, like, hated it so much that I felt like I couldn't even, like, talk to him about, like, my I job think, or anything. Okay, this is this is where I'll say, you know, when you're being, I don't want to see any, of, you never want to see your girl ever with a past whatever. Yeah, you know yeah I of mean? course. And, and when you're tagged, you don't see what it is. And I've seen a few, and it fucks me up. And it kind of does trigger me a little bit. And then I go. Yeah, and he gets I, tagged on. and stuff. It triggers him, and then he takes it out on me. Okay, well, but no, it's like, why well, did you do anything? Well, wrong? here's the reason because I'm. You no, know it's funny about this. Wait, tag can I say you one forever thing? now? Yeah, stop. I know they're going to tag you forever I, now. It's inevitable. I'm sorry, all, <laughs> dude. I, all my comments, like, it, there's a lot of shit. <laughs> He's seen it all now, I guess. I think funny. like, it's not it's not that that pisses me off. It's when I see that, and then I come back and I'm like, I can't go do what I started this channel to be, like to go do this girl stuff. But that's out there and being released that's what it's not the fact that it's that but it's i feel upset that i'm like okay you can post all this stuff but i can't go like just be funny and flirt with but girls i did and, tell you it got to a point where it, i could tell that it was stressing you out so i was like okay just do whatever is best like you're saying despite him filming content with girls you just he was just stressed about what you were doing it, no like he was like because that's like what he started off doing like on YouTube and it worked really well. And like, I know like his fans, they kind of, they want to see that. So, and I saw him like wanting to like please his fans and I want him to succeed on YouTube. So I was like, you know what? Like go back and do it. Like, I don't care. You can flirt with girls if that's like, what's going to like relieve some stress. Cause but nothing, like content wise, it's not good for the relationship, bro. It's like, that's not, if, if I'm doing that, she's, she's actually upset. No, I told you I would, I would have gotten over it. I kept telling him, like, I kept saying, like, go out and do it. It's fine. Like, I don't care. Like, I just want what's best for he you. He seems to think that's not true. Well, that no, is no, true. Th th that, that no, is, I that is true. It. But, like, then she wants to do, like, girl on girl. And, like, I, yeah, I feel uh, weird girl, about it. Yeah. Like, there's, there's always something else that comes along with, okay, if you're going to do that, then I'm going to go do this. Yeah, he always accuses me of scheming. Scheming what? Like she's he's always like, I feel like you're like up to no good. Like you're like planning things. What okay, ever, James is nodding his head. Sorry to put you on. You the ever, like, what the heck? You're, you're, I'm not. No, you are a very smart girl, and you know, you know how to like, you know. She thinks I'm. She thinks I'm just this dumb idiot running around with a camera. <laughs> I'm not dumb. I know. No, I, I know. Are, yeah. She's very smart, and she's. You have to be very smart to be successful where she is. So and what? Am I manipulative? Is you're a little. Man, you're a little manipulative. <laughs> yeah, yep. I love this. No. Yep. I love you this. are. And that's so what truth. are you scheming? Nothing. Oh, that's man. the thing. Can you imagine a whole your whole relationship? You're being so good. I don't even go out. I just no, no, lay in bed all day. Loyal. We're very loyal. I stay loyal. home. And then what is she scheming? I don't want her. Exactly. He's always accusing me of. And I'm like, dude, uh, I don't okay. even leave my nah, house. Gotta, what, are, what is she scheming? He's the one out all the time. No, nah, I feel like it's like, if I say, okay, if I were to say, okay, I'm going to go do this, this girl, sh there'd be some back end, like, okay, let's, let's make this like girl thing. Happen. Cause she's always like, if you're going to do that, this happened the other day, right before we ended. If you're going to do that, I want to do girl and girl. And, and I'm like, and I'm like, okay, well that's not just me going out there and doing this. Like, I'm like, I don't want that to happen. I don't, I just, oh, I see. So then you're like. Do I should I go do this then? Yes, because if I do it, I know there's gonna be that's, some backlash. Damn, <laughs> that's kind of funny. And I will s slip in there also, like in a relationship, it is hard for me to like. I don't want to hurt her. He didn't even I, like I, me I, hanging I, out with Neon though. No, I love Neon. I like Neon. You were skeptical about it at first. With I, what would Neon do? No, here's or the like thing. I I, ho I would host e dates on my Twitch. Like people from all around the world, and he didn't even like that. He'd be like, no, as long as they're I'm all ugly, and I'm like, no. I can't just like. Host <laughs> okay, but here's the thing: no, no, all ugly when guys. that happened, when that happened, she was telling me that I couldn't do the flirting thing with my. Sh so I got upset about that. Uh, I get it. That's it's. Yeah. I'm such an, a, an equal guy in a relationship. That's how I rule. So if 
there's going to be those other things. I'm going to say something if I can't do it. Well, I, I still got to go back to this like new but old thing. Dude, that's really f***ing me up. Yeah, that is. Because all this other shit yeah. is like a conversation. It's like, you. whatever. You guys are Thank talking. Thank you. Okay, no, no. This, I only put out a scene, literally, it was two days before we broke up. While we were like actually like dating, I never bro. like, I didn't have any plans to release any new content but like things were like that was he's the, like i'm gonna go it. do the girl stuff and i'm like okay i'm gonna release this scene then like it was towards it was like two days before we broke up and that really just I was so like, the relationship was basically like done at that point okay i didn't think about do like releasing anything while we were actually together oh that so, changes it then exactly i don't think that changes it i well i was still in it i was still i've always fought could it still work could this still work well, she asked me to move I don't in with think her. he'll ever be okay with my past ever. He he brought it up every single day. Like I really wish okay. you didn't do this. That is not true. That was just for the last month. We've had a like rocky imagine if someone every single day is in your ear like, oh, I hate that you did this. Like that hurts it every hurt day or the feelings. last month. Every day, just, no. This was not every day. What are you talking about? We just a damn near sometimes twice a day. No, this last month has been rough. It has rough. Been. I don't. We have not, we had a great relationship. You'd always say we have a healthy relationship, blah, blah, blah. It's amazing. It was healthy, but it just. It was the last month. Yeah. Or like, okay, something that also was really upsetting towards me is he's Jesus always like, Christ. it's <laughs> different for girls versus guys. Like his body count's oh higher than mine, God. just saying, right? Significantly. But he's like, it's different because I'm a guy. It is different though. But is like, different. is it that Thank, crazy? It different? Thank you. Oh God, no! His, I, okay, I'm, I'm not. I'm. I'm so sorry. She's. I'm not trying to be there. mean. I'm not trying to be mean. I, I'm not trying to be mean either. And I'm not trying to be. She always says you're misogynistic. I. Uh, to a point, I do agree with you, but it's like he's straight up about it. Like you have a hole, and okay. like I'm that like, is not true like at all. Yeah, you, dude, you are putting words in my mouth. That is not That's true at all. That is not true. true at all. That is not true. Babe, I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Slip up. Yeah. That is crazy. Oh wow. Is that true or not? Because I can't tell right now. What? what? Did you actually say that? I, <laughs> no, I did, no, I did no, not. No, he does no. say it. He, she okay. takes it that way. She like says, oh, so you're saying this? And then goes crazy on uh, okay, me. Okay, okay. No, like, and, and then she starts yelling like, me, I resent you. And I'm like, <laughs> Are you guys fighting? Are you guys throwing Dude, hands? She yelled at me. The other day, she yelled Dude, at me. Maybe you just need to punch her one time. And she's punched me. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. She's I'm punching. totally kidding. Like I couldn't get the doubling back on that. I know it's old, but it's new. Like that shit really is just. I could, I'm trying to imagine myself in a situation. I'd be like, oh, dude, I could never do that because everyone else just goes, "This is brand new." You're. Well, a would you date a girl that did anyway? I could. I could, but it, it'd be. Oh man, it'd be difficult. Like it would have to be like it's done. You know. Yeah. Like, yeah. The, the, I don't think you could. No, wow. I don't think you could because I think you're exactly like Nick. You would get tagged and shit. they would comment, they would message you. And I think it would get to you just like how it got to Nick. I think th what does get to me and I'm going to be honest is like, yeah, that shit does bother me. It's just like, dude, I feel like you're a lot like I am. Like you want to have that one on one with the girl, just you two, nothing else. I, I, we, that's it. So it's very hard. Like and we had a, I'm going to we had a very loving relationship. We were very sweet to each other. She always had my back. I always had hers. We were there for everything. Um, when you have that and then there's some of that outside noise, I think, you know, your, your camera guy said it to me once or Nate, Nate, he was like, man, bro, you're just looking at the internet too much. Just, yeah. I should have just, you know, it was all new to me. I've never dated a girl in this situation ever. It's very, it, it is hard. And I will admit that, you know, I had some wrongs, but it is interesting tough, though. Cause tough. like, It'd be different if she just started randomly doing it and then you had to deal with it. Yeah, yeah, I get it. I know, I know what I signed up like for. I know what I signed up for. After she was like 100% mm -hmm. on it. Like 100% And you know what? Even I wish I, I, I would love if I, went, <clears throat> if I went back like two weeks, like look, when I look back at our fights, I'm like, I wish I found out. Like I, I, I know I could get over it. I know, I know I could. She doesn't think I could. But it just got to the point where like if we're both going to resent each other, I don't want to. We didn't want to go out that way. Yeah, I get it. And it, it just, and then, you know, when we split, what, what made you hit me up to, to move in with you? Like, why? why? Like, yeah, because this is like, you're, I feel this like is we're, new. We're holding. Um, so I had been he, looking at houses for a while and I found like a beautiful one. Like I'm in love with it. It's my dream house, but it has five bedrooms and it's just me and my assistant. 
So I was like, I we have to have someone move in, and I asked. Someone. I asked around. I asked you a few other people, but I know she texted me like five times, was calling me about, "Are you gonna move in? Are you not? Are you gonna move in? Are you not?" Like, like <laughs> well, I'll, I'll, I'll say pop up a text. That man. is true, but it's because it's <laughs> pop up a text, <laughs> bro. No. Like she was like on me. And I was Wait, like, dude, so you guys are like breaking up at the same time being like, let's move in. Yeah, and I'm like, the house I'm like, is James. so big though. He's going to be on like a different floor across the house. We won't cross paths. <laughs> There's one kitchen. There aren't that many bathrooms. One back. It's not, it's not that big. Um, well, and how's that going to work? Like, I told you- James, I told James, I'm like, bro, we need to find another house. We did a showing. It's in the video that just dropped. And I get the news that I cannot be on a fucking lease, bro. I can't be on a lease. This was a problem I had two years ago because I, Got student silver cord for throwing an Airbnb party, and it's f-ing me up. And and now we're I don't know. So how's it gonna work? Cause like what? It, I'm like, also like friends with his whole like his two. Group. It's not like we're all strangers or anything. Like the, they're my friends too. I would consider. Yeah. So. And I guess we're just. So friends. wait, you're gonna live in the same house together? <laughs> Roommates. That's fucking insane. <laughs> it's yeah. I don't, I'm scared. How, so wait, wait. I, I think it's only gonna. Are you? Jay, gonna, James said it's gonna last a month. Are you gonna keep? Are you like? What's your plans with content? Are you going to go back to? Um, no, I'm just going to definitely ramp up my only fans, like produce more content. We'll see where it goes. What does that mean? We'll see where it goes. Is there going to be boy girl stuff? Uh, no. That's the question. I, yeah. Would you go back to that? Oh my God. No. I'm, I'm out if that happens. I'm out. Okay. Would you? No, I don't know. What do you mean? What do you, you don't know? Don't know. No, I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> No, 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 what, what, like, no, she, oh, I'm sorry. You, you always said you would never go back. Like, no, like, I'm not going to, I'm not going to. You don't think, you don't think releasing old tape is going back. It was already the person I filmed with it. Like they were already selling it and everything. Like you could find it on the internet. Got it. It's just okay. that I had never pushed it out on mine so, so this is literally already out there somewhere yeah like, yeah it's oh, not like this has never that? seen the face of the I internet don't, i don't know this all person's this sh- he's already like sold it and stuff like you could probably find it if you wanted to but i had just never released but what still it's it, still marketing is like this is new and yeah because no everyone's gonna that. see it i yeah, mean it is new like it's never before seen on my life yet, but it's i didn't just film it i shout see. out that's tough. So why don't you why don't you try to do like I, I guess if you're never if you're not gonna go back to that, obviously like you'd ramp up whatever other content, but like there's so much other shit. I just feel like I've seen you on Twitch. Like I feel like you're That's successful like my there. other main thing, and I do make like decent money yeah. on Twitch, like in it like but I feel like you haven't even given a shot of like all these things you, you could you're well, capable we're in the, of so I'm in much. the middle of moving and everything, so I haven't had time. Moving's well, gonna last like two weeks. Okay, well then I'm getting back into it. But I'm just saying like I like running and only like it's fun. Like I love like posting on it and stuff. And like, you didn't even like that. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> That's like me saying like, Oh, I really hate the gym. Like you do hate the gym. No, I no. don't. Yes, you do. What? No, but that's like giving you shit. I, I, I no, no, no. I tried like, to get you to go to the gym and you freaked out at me and said, stop asking me to go. I there. go through phases. Like I'll go hard in the gym and then I'll take a break. I haven't been going to the gym recently, but like, I'm just saying that's like me like shit on you all the time. Like, or like me being like, it's but, so stupid. You do YouTube, like YouTube's so stupid. Like but, if I came at you for that, that's basically what it was Skyler, like every day. You know, maybe don't realize it, but you are like always coming at me still. Like uh-uh. it's about little, yes, it is. And then when I go out and shoot or anything, you're like, come home right now, come home. You're on me, on me. When you're doing your thing. That was just me being a loving girlfriend, wanting like my boyfriend to come home. That's all But it you was. do it only when I'm out filming. It wasn't, I never thought that you were like cheating or doing anything. It was literally just me being like, but he you, also traveled all the time. Like we yeah. like, Basically, sometimes we even have a long distance relationship. Like he would only be home like a week out of the month. So it's like I wanted to spend as much time as I could with you. Yeah, but I think you know that you were like pretty hard on some shit. With, like I would go to Michigan. I love the and, roll. <laughs> bro, and, and, and James knows and that my team knows like I was so caring and I never want her to feel like not comfortable or, or not safe with anything that's happening. So like it would affect like the videos a lot and like but you were always on me about everything. I apologize. No, no. So, so is it just because you just want to make more money? Like, what is what the reason? Mean? Like, the reason to like continue down that road more? Like, you go harder on whatever. And is it just because, like, I guess what I'm asking is, for you guys to work, 
at some point you guys were both making compromises and it was kind of like you were doing less of the things that were making you money because you you know you're having conversations like okay i'll stop doing this stop doing that mm -hmm. and then he's obviously you know, I, I don't know what you're really necessarily giving up because it's just like, he's just not filming flirting with girls. I, I right? so I, I mean, the whole, that was the whole thing that made me popular was over and over again, the lover boy and yeah. there'd be some situation I was in and people love to see just because it's not like I'm some super, super smooth dude. I'm like funny and awkward and it's like, yeah, like, what the f is he even saying? But I saying? feel like people love to see you guys together too. Yeah. Like early on, like I, those are the, some of the first videos I saw like that popped the most. It's tough because like we both talked about this. It's like, it's fun. It's fun to film together. We had a great time. We did some like it was, it was fun adventures, whatever, going, whatever, doing whatever. But at some point, like you don't want to just be on camera together. You want to have like a, a real relationship. Yeah. So it was like every once in a while, it'd be fun to do something and like do that. And she would, you know, she loved to support me and it, it was fun. But uh, I don't want my whole thing to be about. Yeah, I get it. I understand that. So I have a question then, like, obviously I'm not going to be like, this is never going to work, whatever. I think that's silly. That's not how life works. But don't take offense to this question, but I have to ask you this question. Do you think? What kind of guy could you date that was like, you think would be completely okay? It feels like, I, if, if you're thinking like, oh, I wouldn't be okay with it. You're looking at me like that. So the only other guy then would be like a guy who's in pornography. Yeah, which I would never do. Yeah, that's why I don't have any hope for having <laughs> oh, I'm actually just going to stay single. <laughs> don't say that. Um, it, no, yeah, that is really scary because I think the <sighs> yeah, it usually is guys that uh, are in themselves or I don't know because there are a lot of people that I think would date me, but I just always think it's going to be a thing where eventually they're like, okay, I don't think I don't like this. Like I was talking to um, Lena, who's like my, she's my only You manager. thought she was gonna say a guy's name there, huh? No, no. For a no. second. <laughs> He's like, what the uh, She me, She texted me talks. the other day. She was like, me and Adam are arguing whether or not you and Nick broke up. And I was like, no, like we did break up. Um, it's just been tough. Like, cause he, like the whole point of things getting to him. And she answered, she's like, yeah, I'm so sorry. Like that happens to like every girl in and like the guys are always chill with it in the beginning and then uh they always like end up being like kind of it's tough not controlling but like not it kind of gets that which i don't blame him like i don't blame him at all i really don't like i think that would get to me too like if i had to be tagged and stuff and like it, like my comments are filled with it whatever um i just think that it started to feel like i was the bad person like it was like I was the one that was like, he was mad at when it was other people like writing comments and stuff. Like yeah. I wasn't doing anything. I was a, a perfect girlfriend, like loyal. You don't think you're doing anything more that would create more like <laughs> drama? Like for the audience to be like, well, she's doing this now. I really you. didn't do anything during our relationship. I mean, maybe like the E-date stuff people like thought was crazy. I don't like know. Like neon and whatever. That yeah. was whatever though. Yeah. So, so that's what I'm saying. Like, just, I'm really curious, genuinely. Like, so you say you move apart at some point, let's say it doesn't work. How, like, who are you, who in your mind are you, like, what kind of guy are you finding that you think, you think it's going to be like, you're just have to get completely out of it at some I point? I would think, I think so you like what really I would have to do is do only for as long as I could. And then when I've had enough of LA move somewhere else and just like meet someone organically is there ever a time and have be like far removed from i guess is there is there ever a time that you would give up all this okay you ask that all the time but it's like i'm still so young the money i wondering. made isn't gonna last me in the next like 80 years i still have to make money there's other ways to make money but we've talked about that okay no but I, i'm just curious because like you know. And also another thing is I have fans too. Like I care about my fans and like my fans want to see content and like I like making my fans happy. I, like just how you like making your fans happy with YouTube. Like I have fans too. Like they're not just like I just don't, I just it's don't. not just like this thing that I like do for money. Like I do like having like supporters and stuff like that. Like you know I have a Discord with people I talk to like all day. Like it's But you know what? Like I think you could make a ton of money, maybe not money 
and still be super comfortable and happy. Why can't I like doing all You could do No, so. I'm saying you can still do it. I'm not saying you can't. I'm saying at some point, like, there, if you want, like, a solid, solid relationship, unless it's with someone in that industry, mm -hmm. and I don't even know how you feel about that personally, but, like, like you said, you even know that every guy's going to come to that conclusion, like, uh, maybe I'm kind of uncomfortable with this. Yeah. <clears throat> I think, to your point, you are entertaining enough as just a person on camera mm -hmm. that you could still be successful, and it's maybe... Maybe it's not two million dollars a month. Maybe it's five hundred thousand, two hundred thousand, whatever. Like mm -hmm. it, that's still sustainable, good money. It's yeah. great money. And like, yeah, I guess for me the question is like, when is it enough? Because at some point, like, you're never, you're not going to be able to take back all the stuff. Which I know that's part of your reason why kind of going back into it or like maybe diving more headfirst into like doing more of that content because you can't take it back because you've already there, people labeled you as this. Yeah. Right. But at some point, like, you can still make good money outside of it. And, like, if you know that and you know that, like, if you say you did this for five more years and you kind of did more and more, mm. you're either, you're setting yourself up even more for some guy in the future to be like, ah, it's too much. Right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And personally, in my defense of all, like, you know, how she feels about it getting to me, you know, you can't, I can't go change her. You can never change anyone. You got to let them do what they want to do. But personally, like, I know her. This is. To me, I will. I, I do admit that she is probably the most incredible woman, girl I've ever met in my life. I could see her. I could see being forever. I, I could have, um, but it's like, like I can't. I see what you're saying. She could do so so many things. She's brilliant. She's amazing. And I don't know. I, I don't think you have to. Because because my question is like, if you keep doing it more and more, and then you find someone that you're like, hey, this is the guy. Like some guy. Let's say it's him or some other guy. Like whatever. And you know that it's going to get to that point where he's like, oh, I can't deal with this because you keep doing it. Like, my point is that the stuff doesn't just go away. It's kind of just always there. Right. It's not right? that it's not for me. And for things, I don't think it's not even that you can't deal with it almost. It's like, I believe you can do more. Well, yeah, it's just twofold. It's twofold because I think about it and you're going to hear all the, you know, all the red pill commentary stuff is like, you can't, it's like your, your, your idea is I'm going to make as much money as I can and then find someone who is okay with it. That's that's pretty hard. That's that's going to be a harder task than just finding someone who's like, if you're kind of like slowly getting out of it and moving on to other things, because mm -hmm. the guy that you find, let's say now it's like three more years of more of that stuff. It's like more, more, more. At some point, it's just like for any guy is going to be like, yo, what the? F yeah. So that's what I'm saying. Like you, you're not just like I think you're good at conversation. You're good at speaking. You're good at just being on camera. Like none of this. Mm -hmm. And it's like just do more of that and take less money. Cause at some point, right. It's like, right. How much do you need? I know, you know, you hear that. Oh, I don't make money until 80, whatever. Like, you know, but you could still make great money in this space without doing that. And I'm not trying to convince yeah. you to stop. I'm just saying in, in your thinking of, I'm going to do a bunch more and go harder and then find the guy. Like who's to say it just doesn't happen. And now you're just older and you're going in that cycle with a different guy. Right. Yeah. And to me, I think about that. I'm like, that's scary to me. Like if I was you, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. I don't know. It sounds like you guys are just trying to convince me to stop. No, no, no. I, you do whatever you want. Like, mm -hmm. I can't, you know, I'm just, I'm just talking about the things you're saying, like your mm -hmm. idea of what you would do. Mm -hmm. Cause I think you're, I think you're <laughs> entertaining. Like you can Thank be entertaining you. outside of all the shit that's just, amazing. I think it's probably honestly the red pill comments that I, cause I get so much and they like overpower like other stuff. Yeah. So it's like, like you're only ever just going to be a I'm like, okay, like, that's not I'll just true. keep running my own. That's, that's then. Oh, like, I you can't listen to those idiots. <laughs> that's not true at all. I don't know, but I, it's not like OnlyFans tour to me though. I love like, I like making the content. It's fun. Yeah, I get it. I, Cause I like, I feel the most confident when I get to like be. Single. So it's like, I don't know. It's like fun for me, I guess. Yeah, it's your thing. There's nothing wrong with it. I'm just yeah. saying it's like, it's your choice, you know, but, but you're going to run into that issue again maybe with some guy was like uh yeah now it's more yeah you know i also don't think i would date anyone in social media you think lesson you learned damn it's a good lesson i guess <laughs> to save him honestly yeah i feel so one thing i've always said about like when i got into porn, i never wanted it to affect the people around me and I'm really upset that he was affected by it and it like weighed on me heavily. Like I felt so bad that he was like being 
like getting receiving like the mean comments like making fun of him for even dating me like that was like weighed on me really heavy too like i i, I felt bad like i genuinely felt so bad because i don't think he deserves that he was just with me because he loved me like yeah and in the beginning like you were getting that but you were good with it and it just wear it on you I'm, i mean i'm just gonna be real like i think I, I was never like big on twitter i'm still not so nothing that's my lowest platform i think i, I started twitter. like yeah i started posting on there more and like they do okay and then all of a sudden I started getting tagged on there and that's where like, that's where the, and I started seeing it and really, I, I'm going to be honest, like that did head up a bit, but I, looking back as before that, I never took anything out on her. And I, I feel so bad that that, you know, some nights ate at me. I really do feel bad. And I'm sorry. It's okay. I really am sorry. It's okay. So you guys are going to like live together though now, which is interesting. It's yeah. very weird to me. How long do we think it's going to last? I think it's going to last two months. Two months? I think he's, you got some, you'll stick it out a little bit. You think two months? I, yeah. I'm very like. I know. I like, think the second uh, that he, I like see a girl in his video, I'm going to be like, get the f out. <laughs> <laughs> like. <laughs> we shouldn't watch today's video. Are, are you serious? No, I mean like. It's What's in it? Nothing. We'll talk about oh it after. Oh my God. What's in it? Nothing. What do you well, mean we, nothing? We dress the, we, we dress the breakup. Okay. And we go out for James's birthday. That's annoying. <laughs> That's annoying. I just find it funny. You couldn't so even wait like a week. Imagine if I went out and Hold on a fucking... second. You're releasing something. <laughs> yeah. That's, That's why. Oh, you this didn't is even why. wait a week. Come oh, on. This is, but here's my you, thing. You, he okay, went no, in on. person and did something with someone and talked Listen. to them. I had Listen. someone two years ago and Listen. just ruined it up. Listen. You drop. I, we don't even announce that we're this broken is, up. I never go to. Hilarious. I never go to the internet. You drop. You're the one who drops. We broke up. It goes viral on TikTok. <laughs> Two days later, announce on your Twitter. You're I dropping didn't a boy think girl it was scene. Get clipped. I was just on TikTok live. So I was like, F it. I'm gonna go do my thing. You didn't even wait a week that you like actually went out and like pursued a girl, like talked to her in person. Like I'm. It's not that serious. It's not. It's not us. I don't at the think club he's really right. pursuing girls like that. No, hell you're no. Annoying. I don't. I don't take any girls number. I don't do anything. I don't text. It's not like that. It's. Just, it's like you know, you're out with the guys. It's fun. You're making a, a, a video. So you would be fine if I like like started like. Doesn't matter. It's over. So it doesn't really matter. <laughs> no, no, no. Finish that. Finish that. If you like, do I don't know, like, say I, like, went out and, like, linked with, like, a YouTuber or a streamer or something. I don't do anything with you anyone. wouldn't care? I don't do any. Here's the thing. I don't I wouldn't do hurt your feelings. I don't do anything with anyone, anyone popping or anything like that. I don't go, you know, do. It's still a pretty girl. Wait, what do you like, mean by popping? What do you, you mean? Just, What's the difference between that? She's going popping? out and she wants to, like, flirt with all these big people out here, make it go super viral, go back to her only. I like, get it. I get it. It's like, I'm, I won't do anything. I, I'm so careful about like hurting her feelings or anything like that I always have been my stuff is like so innocent and i'm dumb i'm not like it's not it's not like that it's just like like she goes and does all these flirting comments acting touching i'm like that's not me i'm not gonna do that like it's touching very, it, it's I don't very be touching people what are you talking whatever, whatever, about like, whatever whatever like whatever whatever you're implying that you're gonna go do i don't know what you're gonna no, go do. no i'm just saying like what if i went out and did something like that exact same like what if you saw me like flirting in a video with a guy that what, what if i started doing like it's like i wouldn't care okay now you wouldn't care i wouldn't you think you'd care if you guys were, what, what no if you, i don't i think i think he's a little okay. weird for okay. it <laughs> i'm not actually gonna do that that's not something i would do but let's just like think about the roles reverse you're Dude, doing, what if you just say and just do it with her that's yeah. what I was saying the whole time. I was like, oh, shit. let's just, nah. just quit the YouTube. Let's run nah, up the bag I together. I don't believe in that. Much. You he can't do it? Like, no, I would yeah. never. <laughs> I would never do that. Yeah, I get it. This is yeah, I don't judge you. Certain that. boundaries for sure. Yeah, well, maybe that's what you got to find. You got to find here. like a, what? Some people have morals, apparently. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> maybe you just got to find someone to do that with. <laughs> no. No. So, so you wouldn't do I'm that? I'm not. No, I'm never. No. What are you saying in front of me right now? No. What yeah. the f are you doing? I, I mean, sorry, 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 sorry. Like, He's trying like, to put ideas in my it's head. It's not like we're just no, all no, like, feelings are I gone and go shit. Like, and no, no, no. I think, you, I think you guys, I think this I will works. Say, I, I will say that people works. do not know what her and I have gone through behind, behind the scenes. We have not shown. This is like the most we've shown right here. Yeah. And we've gone through a lot that people probably never know that that did like bond us and like. I'm gonna be honest. Where I don't do, think you guys are really breaking up. 
I don't you, think you guys are. We what? sit here and laugh though, but behind closed doors, it's not laughing. It's like serious. Like it's like I've anger. When I saw her, anger. When she <laughs> when she yelled at me the other day, and I'm not saying I'm 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 right for for anything or how we already went over all of it. It just kind of like was like damn like. She yelled, she literally yelled at me, I resent you. I'm not in love with you anymore. Oh. And, and. Yeah, that was really messed up. And, do. you know, it, may, it was not maybe true, but it, it was a point of like, man, we cannot. Yeah, yeah. Go you want to burn, you want to yeah, burn it like that. Yeah. yeah. Like this, this girl means a lot to me. And I, truth, I truthfully, like, I do love you. And I, I truthfully am in love with you. Um, Damn. But it just. I have to be. Go pee. I'm sorry to say that. No, that moment, I'm like about to burst. She's not good with emotions at all. I'm telling you, like, hor- like we Dude. don't. That, like the biggest thing is like we have a hard time communicating on like. A lot yeah, of that. yeah. Just, Dude, I get it, man. I get it. I've had so man nothing, nothing like this, like stuff to deal with. But it's normal, man. Like dealing yeah. with not working. I, I, but I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't think, I don't think it's done. I think you guys will still be dating in a year from now. I, for real. I don't know, man. I don't think it'll be the same. It's tough, bro. But neither of us can let go of things. It's like, it's like the, the compromise that she wants me to, to do. It's like, I, I got it. And then what I want, when I'm not cool with her, like she feels she got to do it. But what is, the, so I want her on this too, but what, for, from your perspective, what is the compromise that needs to happen? Or would like, if, if you did everything she wanted you to do, what would that look like? So I think the compromise is, okay. I really want to like bring back the girl. Shit. Like, by I the say, way, I just want to tell you that's going to go super viral when she, when you said, I love you. And she said, I have to go pee. I don't know if you want to cut that out or not. I don't, I don't know. I'm used to, I'm, I'm used to it because <laughs> I'm when, just like, that's whenever, ringing in my head right whenever now. deep things come up between us that are like very, like very real. Yeah. She can't talk about it with me. Like I, I, I think the one thing I am good at is like even completely off camera. What? Off camera. Off camera. What? The same thing. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Off camera, off camera, she's not, babe. Oh my god. Yo, you guys are. Do you guys? Do you run away from like emotional shit? I don't purposely run away from it. I'm just really bad at like communicating how I feel. Like he'll ask me like talk like he'll want me to like he'll press me to try and get deep about it's how not I feel. Pressing. It's like just <laughs> it hey, feels like you're it. trying to understand. Yeah, I'm trying to yeah. understand. Like I don't want to like. Yeah, I want to. But for some reason. My brain, when it comes to like emotions, I can feel emotions, but it's, I can't like, I can't think of words to even like describe how I feel when it comes to emotions. Huh. She, I'm going to say this. I don't know if it's too personal. She didn't even know, like when our relationship started, like she wasn't even a kisser. Like she never, she said she never like really like in real life, really kissed someone and meant it. And she didn't. She was never even into kissing me, like until then. Yeah, I, I don't really even like being touched either. I'm I not very the top like kiss, the middle person. kiss, the bottom kiss. I wonder if that's just because of the work that you've done. No, I, I've just, I just. I think I've always been like that. Even before you ever did that stuff. Yeah. You just like. Is that I, I, I was always really scared of intimacy. I didn't like have my first. I had my first kiss and had sex in the same night, like all at once. Whoa, like I've never like. Had like the cute like first kiss type thing. I like just was so scared of intimacy or anything like that. So then when I like turned eighteen, I got like some type of confidence, and I was like, I'm finally gonna do it. So here's here's my here's this is interesting. You said that about the being afraid of intimacy and like just I don't know. This is maybe me speaking just from my older perspective, mm-hmm. but I wonder if like the reason why deep down it kind of is not working is just because of that same exact reason like and you kind of people tend to make oh i gotta do this and it's somewhat of an avoidance of having to actually Mm -hmm. deal with the thing that is just harder for you to deal with right which is just being more intimate honestly i think you're onto something with that maybe that's why because he's the opposite he's so loving like so like wants to just spill his heart out to me all the time but i'm so like i feel those things but i can't communicate it and so maybe that's why because i wasn't able to give you the reassurance and like the in that like emotional intimacy that you probably needed so that's why you got extra insecure about seeing me have intimate moments with other people wow that just made sense in my head sure that's (laughs) true i think the biggest thing though like when we started 
dating or when we started even talking, she didn't like, she, she liked me, but she didn't even know why she felt safe around me, comfortable, but she would always push me away until the point of blocking me for like two months. And then she would come back and she kept saying, I don't know why I keep coming back. And to the point, I didn't really understand how to go about it. I'm like, dude, you keep fucking with me and playing with me. And I talked to someone who's a lot more mature than me. And he's like, yo, this girl's like never really been loved before. And he's like, you love her. Why don't you just really actually show that to her? So I did. I was just very vulnerable, very open. And then she started coming around and being more loving and following me to the point where like, you know, two yeah, because like people, if you don't, if you've never really had those sort of like experiences, you don't really know how to give them. Yeah. Dude, I, I, remember, I still remember the first night she didn't even know, like, know how to kiss. She was like, teach me. Okay, like, thank you. Seriously, like there's, we've come from that. And she would never, <laughs> before she would never open up to me, talk to me about anything. And it got better and better. But there, there was, there is like this like wall that she still has not let me through. And it's not like her fault or anything. And the fucked up thing is like, I think that that's the reason why it's not worth that deeper thing. It's not just you thing. It's mm -hmm. a combination of him probably being and, more so. And I probably haven't it. handled it maturely. Like I should have. Sometimes I get frustrated and I'm sorry for that as well. I, I think we're both just figuring things out. I haven't been in a serious relationship since I was like in high school. I don't even know if you can consider that serious. So we're both kind of like new to all of this. Have you ever gone to therapy? Like a little therapy? bit. Yeah. yeah. You guys should try like couples therapy. <laughs> but it's like, should we have to do that if we were only together for like, if you want it to work, long? if you want it to work, you know, I, I, that's probably like a bad sign though for relationships. I don't think you so. You need to go to therapy like seven I, months in. Yeah. But don't I don't think know. that's so, like, because that there's probably, tough. that sounds scary. That's no, like, this is <laughs> no, 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 because I think it's, it's not so much as therapy for you guys to work. It's therapy for each of you individually to see how you guys are showing up for the, your partner. And True. I think there's probably things, both of you that like, maybe Nick's more over, over loving, over giving. And like, maybe part of that, it creates uncomfortableness within you. Cause you find yourself not being able to do the same sort of things. And he's like, because he's doing it, he's kind of expecting it. Cause that's normally how people act, right? Like they give and they kind of like, well, how come I'm not, depending on what like your love language is. Like if someone's super like touchy and they like, that's the way they show love and they touch you, but then you never touch them. They're like, well, what is, is it not the same? And then like, they get their own insecurities that aren't even having to do with your work and all this other shit. So it's like you guys may not fully understand that about each other because like you individually don't understand that like fully about yourselves, like what you really truly need and how you truly need it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. it's just kind of like when I look at it, because like you guys right now, if I'm looking at you, I don't think it's done. In my mind, it's not done. And like just because the things you're saying and the way you're interacting and it's like obviously there's something going on. It's tough, but like. I think it could be fixed. Doesn't need to. Obviously, it's not up to me. It's not my life. But like when when I talk to you about where you want to go and like what you want to do, it's just in your mind. And this is fine. Like if you don't want to have a family and you don't want to have this or that, whatever. And if you just want to make a ton of money, then just like keep chasing that. But I could tell from I could tell you from experience, not in I've spent a lot of my life just chasing that. Mm -hmm. And I'm 34 years old. and I look back and I'm like, damn, I kind of wish I spent more time like chasing a solid relationship. Right. And yeah. I, I never, I never looked at that hard enough. And now I find myself being like, I wish I gave that more time to mm -hmm. just develop certain things within myself to be able to show up the right way for the people that I wanted to be with. Right. So again, none of there's no right or wrong here, but like your direction of where you want to go is just like, you're just looking at money and I get it. Right. But mm -hmm. you know, at some point, unless that's all you want, it's just like, wh where are you? Where are you going to be? Yeah. I don't know. That's just like what motivates me right now. Yeah. I ha I've only been doing this for like two years. Like it, I don't know. I feel like yeah. it's, I'm still in like the beginning phase of my career. And it was, I just felt like I could never do anything. Like I was always scared to stream on Twitch because I would always be scared. Like something would happen that would upset him. Like yeah. I, or I would say, or I would do something or I would be scared to even like, that's like how when I feel I about went, our videos. When I That's went and I did the I'm, neon and Sneeko stream, like the whole time I'm like texting him because I'm like scared. Like, did I say something that offended you? And it's just like when you having that mentality, like I felt like it was having like an effect on like my performance of like just being entertaining in yeah, general. Okay, yeah. this is and this is why I think like, you know, you break up for a reason, and that's why I think we should at least see why. Cause I've lost my, like, I feel like I've lost my purpose. I'm so scared to even talk in the videos to everyone. Like it, both of us, I think she's right. I'm right. Both of us have lost, like feel a little lost. Yeah. We can't do what we like set out to do. Yeah. And like, yeah, that's that.
Yeah, I mean, it makes sense. It makes sense. And well, it, honestly, the best thing you guys could be doing is like maybe, yes, take a little time and like see what you really, really want. Because when time is apart, you'll be like, oh, damn, did I really want this that way? And you also give yourself space to breathe and like see if the things you're doing individually are really what you want to also be spending more time doing. Right. You know? So I think you guys are on the right path. Again, I, I don't think it's to me. I know you guys are broken up or whatever, but it doesn't seem that way. Especially because you guys are moving in. That's like insane we haven't had sex for like two months so damn at least we're not like buddies or anything like that i feel like that's what causes people to get back together when you like Fuck start him. like you go back to yeah that's tough damn two months maybe like a month and a half i was gone for a long time damn you've been that's crazy and then we it's crazy and then i feel like both of us when we fight and like have this these feelings neither of us want to do anything like it's very like yeah it's very intense emotional i've never and i think with her too like neither of us have had people who've ever made us like weak or soft for someone else or it's just very it's a lot all right quick interruption for the podcast shady rays check this out i actually have really not bad eyesight i have great eyesight but i have really bad eyes when it comes to light so shady rays got my back super dope really like just clean not overdone well designed and yeah, so listen, if I drive, like if I drive at night, this sounds crazy when some guys night, like you're insane. But if I drive at night, I have my eyes are like, like they're like a weird shaped pupil. So I'll get like migraines and shit, there's too much light. Pop the glasses on and I'm flying. But Shady Rays will protect your eyes. If you, you know, you're like this, cause I drive like this sometimes. I'm like, fuck, I'm gonna get a migraine. Pop it on, I'm like this, boom. Just, just focused. Or like sometimes I'll be driving PCH and like the sun will be setting and it'll be like right in your eyes, bang, shady rays, bang, easy. Uh, like people just crashing around me, I'm good. And also the stylish. So shadyrays.com, code raw talk, 50% off, two pairs or more. Do it right now. Great for a gift or don't have a gift for your loved one and be an asshole. It's up to you. Shadyrays.com, code raw talk. Let's go. So what 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 could make it work? What do you think? I honestly think. It would have to be time. Like he has to go do his thing. Like really, like grind out his YouTube. Because I just think that's what I don't know. I just think we need time. What about you? <laughs> I don't know. I got it. man. It's just uh... like honestly, like if you could right now continue it, would you continue it? It's it like, was just constant fighting, like constant, yeah, it's, it's, constant. We both were, I remember the, like the day before we were both texting each other, like we're just exhausted. Don't want to do that. Don't yeah, fight I'm tired anymore. of fighting. It's just like, it was never like that. Yeah. And I can't do, I can't do that more. She can't do that more. I don't want to make her upset. She doesn't want to make me feel upset. Um, but how are you going to do if you're living in the same house and she has some girl coming over to film a scene? Uh, yeah, I'm out. <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to bring anything to the house. Okay. Yeah, because, like, <laughs> I, I think do. it's going to be fun. I stay in my room most of the time, like, whenever I'm home. I'm not really, like, I don't ever, like, hang out in, like, the living room or anything. Should be and good. And he travels a lot, so. We'll see. It's true. Damn. So, so are you working on anything else besides this, this like, more only stuff? Streaming. Twitch. I have a sick setup. It just... Where it gets set up tomorrow. Or what? Desktop or like IRL? Yeah, desktop. Stuff. I do have an IRL set up, but I haven't used it yet. So maybe I'll get into that. IRL's the f wave, dude. IRL scares me. Why? Because all this like crazy sh is happening. Oh. <laughs> I like whenever I'm around, like, because I've done like a few IRL streams, it's like they're like tapped into like a different energy. It's like the, the streamers or the, the audience? The streamers, they're just yeah. like, it's like, get a viral clip by any means yeah. like yeah. that type of vibe. That's crazy. Yeah. Would you ever do IRL stuff? We're starting two weeks. We made our Twitch. We made our streaming uh, YouTube. We announced it on the channel. We start in two weeks. Yeah. IRL. I'm excited. You're starting it too? Yeah. Well, me and Steve have a show. We just oh. haven't, we haven't like been consistent with it yet just because we're, we're where yeah, we yeah. live at. Oh, it's going to go. It's going to go great. Yeah. yeah. Um, we're going to start on the 19th. Are you guys going to bring Steiny on? He'll, he'll probably show up here or there. Yeah. I know he's with him right now in Miami, but we're going to... That's the trio. We're going to do something in, in, at my gym, and like, I guess I'm supposed to like wrestle like little people. Oh, my God. See how many little people I can wrestle? <laughs> yeah, because we just put like a That's matted good. area in the gym. I know, yeah, I saw that. See how many it would take to take me down. 
That's amazing. How many do you think it'll take? I don't know, bro. You f me up when you. I think you could take all of them. Maybe like. Yeah, I wonder how many. Yeah, like fifteen. Are you gonna be scared to hurt them? Kinda, yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. yeah I'm a little afraid, I'm afraid to hurt for them. Because like, if I like, what if I like throw an elbow or something and I hit one? You, they wouldn't reach your elbow, right? <laughs> well, I, they might be climbing. You know what I'm saying? Uh, like, it's sign like some a, waivers, man. Yeah, definitely sign some waivers <laughs> for sure. <laughs> but you, you, you wouldn't do IRL stuff. No, I would. I'm just saying it's kind of scares me a little bit. I need to like stick with my desktop streams because. I do a lot of like try on stuff. They really like that. On a desktop, you just oh yeah, I see. Yeah, like just I'll like try on different like costumes and stuff like that. Yeah, because your Twitch does good. Yeah, it does really good. Yeah, like but that's what I'm saying. Like you don't like there's so much money in that. You're just like you just think there's so much more in the OF stuff that you're just like F I'll do more of this. It's it's hard when like that's what I'm known for. So it's hard to drive away from it, and my fans just want new content so bad but this and is what i find interesting that's what i'm known for but you seem so ambitious to like you were even saying earlier how like you know the money you have right now is probably great money but you're not going to have it forever like you're not going to be 80 with it mm -hmm. that's still true and it's like if that's true then like why not like evolve into some other form of content that like is actually more sustainable because the of isn't what do you think sustainable twitch I think I think speaking content sustainable. I think like podcast stuff sustainable. Mm -hmm. Any anything like that can get clipped. Like you talk about the streamers, like we gotta get some viral clip because yeah. the way the platforms now work, where it's all this clip based stuff, but long format stuff like podcasts, I think are sustainable. Mm -hmm. We've seen that, and right. also because the questions, like if I ask you a question, it gets clipped. It's all over TikTok, right, and like yeah. that's pushing that content forward. Even if the platform on YouTube where the the podcast itself isn't getting as many views, mm -hmm. it's sustainable. I guess it's probably the comments. Yeah, like. Just reading, like, I, I would assume that they wouldn't want to hear me talk. I don't think so. <laughs> but remember, that's the thing. Like, if, if you also go, well, that's what I did. That's what I've known for. Then, and you just kind of keep diving into that, then mm -hmm. that's where you're stuck. Mm -hmm. And you don't actually get out of that. Right. Not to say that you need to or want to, but, like, if you're talking about being business savvy and focused, like, which I really believe you are, then like at some point you will have to evolve into some other form of, right. unless your goal yeah, is no, like, I know that too. That's how people stay relevant. You have to adapt. Yeah. Unless you're like, I'm just going to make so much money doing this shit and then just like disappear. Right. Yeah. But even no. still like based on your thoughts, it doesn't seem like that's what you would do. Mm -mm. So at some point you have to make a transition to something. Right. Switch. Yeah. Speaking, I think, I think you're, I mean, you're entertaining. Thank I've seen you. some of your stuff on Twitch. Thank you. I did. I think I rated you once. Yes, you yeah, did. Yeah. I okay. tried to raid you, but then you only you had your thing set to like members only chat, and I was the like, "Well, that's that gonna mean? be no fun." Because then my, that's when you have it set to. I didn't know that. Only people that are subscribed to you can comment. So like the fun thing about raiding is everyone then comes everyone in goes like, and they'd go crazy in the chat. But I was I couldn't raid you because I was like, "That's gonna be no fun." Like you, you should there, text no one's me. gonna be in his chat or anything. You should told me I would have opened it up. I didn't know that. Yeah, you have to. It's fun. That's what makes the. Twit streaming fun. That's all I do the whole time. Just read the comments and interact with them. Yeah. They'll like tell me what to do and stuff. So. Yeah, it's fun. And so, yeah. so you you've done you haven't really done much streaming before, but you're gonna start doing straight into IRL. Yeah, I think straight into IRL. I'm not like a we'll have, we we want to get like a sit down thing. James and I are sharing a room in the house, bunk beds. But uh, you guys are like like bunk beds yeah we're not doing what we used to do where we used to share a bed and travel no we together. never shared yeah bed. yeah you whatever, Jacob shared whatever man they used to uh, <laughs> they used to that's not true he shared a bed with so many people i heard he used to cuddle with steiny steiny and i Bro, shared a room my, the guy who was in here the guy who just walked out i swear they used to kiss or something oh my dude. God. man i'm very close to my friends we're just bros though nothing no nothing. him 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 i swear <laughs> they used to kiss dude <laughs> dude you were the one when we would be like on our little adventures in cabo and Text me, Nick, when are you coming back into bed? No, <laughs> yes. never. Yes, these guys, did. these guys, I swear to God, because like we, we'd be there gambling or whatever, they'd be like sleeping on the couches next to each other. Like it was weird. No, Steve would be like, make sure you text Nick. Like I want you guys like comfortable. Like yeah, yeah. okay. They would always get sushi together. It was sus. Uh -huh. Is he ever doing any sus stuff? Yeah, he hugs everyone all the time. It's not sus, I, dude. I'll be like, let me get a hug. Oh yeah, let me get another hug. He'll go back for the my, double dude, hug. Dude, my supporters who come up to me like you're like, the let I'm, me get a hug guy. I hug all my, everyone. Who comes to me, yeah, like, uh, what's wrong with hugging my bros? No, nothing. 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 It we, doesn't we come hug. across as sus though. It just comes across you're just such a little lover boy. Damn, I'm a lover boy. <laughs> Represent. So what? It's like what do you want? Like do you want like an asshole? A what? Like do you want an asshole? Because like why what are we getting? That? Wait, what do you? Because like, like, oh, as a guy, but you're yeah, ready yeah, like yeah. a literal. So I was no, like, what are you no, talking? What the f 
<laughs> no. no, because he's such a lover boy. <laughs> no, I like nice guys. Yeah. So Dude, I don't like guys. all the loving I did. If I didn't do that for like a little bit, she would go crazy and be like, why aren't you blah, blah, blah. And she's like, I need like, uh, it's not like she didn't like it. You're dragging it. Damn. You're dragging it. <laughs> right, let's end this. Shit, no, this no. You guys are. Dude, you guys are so entertaining. Right, to me. Done, man. You guys should just have a podcast. There you go. There it is. Do a podcast. Just- Talk about relationship drama and problems. <laughs> we bring yeah. on guests and we just get in fights together. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was going to say so you funny. can do like the plug talk stuff. No. <laughs> what? What? I've never watched plug talk. Oh, you know what it is, oh. right? What? Not really, actually. I kind of just. You don't know what that is? Well, I know it's Lena's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What did they talk about on there? It was like, a joke. It was a joke. Okay. So you interview someone and then you really don't know. I really don't know that. Okay. I don't. Yeah. <laughs> yeah that's what that. Would, that's what that is. That's not for you. That's not. I'm gonna step out of that one. Yeah. Okay. Stick with the hugs, you know. <laughs> Stick with the yeah, hugs. Instead of <laughs> after I hug them, you know. Oh my god. So so. <laughs> one more question. Oh no. <laughs> no no. It's Can good. I leave? <laughs> no, it's good. Oh man. Um. Why are you laughing, bro? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what is going on it's right now? It's the living situation. Really funny to me. <laughs> Oh, we have we have rules. We're good. What are the rules? Um, can't sleep in the. I can't be in her room. Not sleep in the same bed. Um, you said. Can I say something you said before we started here and before she was here? I'm so scared. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, it was not crazy. It's not crazy. It's not crazy. What is it? It was like a rule if you guys broke up. Okay, say is it. Is it okay? What he said that if you guys broke up, it's a rule that like you guys. Yo, you're like dripping <laughs> your no! face. In- it's your scary. face you is say? tripping. You're just me up right say now. it. Just say you it. You can God. cut this if you don't want this. God damn it. it. Just say it. Okay. You guys can't sleep with someone for a year. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. That is a rule. She made that rule. Yep. That, you could both stand by that? No sleeping with any girls while you're under my house. Wait, would you actually wait a year to have sex with anyone else? Yes. You promise? Yep. Interesting. So you got a year. You got a year to figure this out. Okay. <laughs> Let's let it figure itself out. <laughs> I'm just don't. saying, dude. All well, audience things were delusional. No, it's funny. It, this is the <laughs> craziest is, situation. Well, it is. It's it's an interesting thing because like you guys did put it out there. It's like a mm-hmm. you can't. It's it's not. I that's by Wait, all means actually, a very hard. This isn't thing. out there till this releases Tuesday. Yeah, that is, we don't announce any of that till Sunday. We just. But regardless, figured, I'm just saying, yeah. like the dynamic of like the, oh yeah, the, the yeah. dating is dynamic insane. is is a really unique one. <sighs> yeah. Super unique. I'm scared for everyone else that lives in the house. Why? I'm scared. <laughs> Yo, look at them. They're all arguing. nodding their head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because they see, they, they witness everything that happens between yeah. us. The cute, loving shit and the angry shit. And it's all in front of them. Mm-hmm. Dude. And it's like sides because he has, his boys are on his side. My sister Riley's on my side. Oh, I know she lies for her. I know. <laughs> no, oh my she doesn't. God. Oh my God. I'm an angel. So are you, you going to film content in the house then? Do you need content stuff? Is it gonna be like a content house? I don't know. We just <laughs> we're just all moving in together, and yeah. But if you're gonna be streaming and shit, it's like it's gonna end up being a content house. Yeah, it sounds fun. Not I'm gonna pull up. You want to move in? I'm gonna pull. I'm gonna move in. Well, yeah. you're coming for okay. Friendsgiving. Yeah, and I'm gonna move in. Okay. Who are you bringing? For she you? already told me before this podcast I can come move in. Okay. Imagine. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I'm kidding. That's yeah. a. Well, you know a, what? <laughs> maybe she never texted me. Maybe by let's the way. go back to our old ways. Instead of the bunk beds, we'll get a bed, and you and I can. Yeah, we'll cuddle just like before, and I'll braid your hair. Okay. <laughs> okay, um, so what's happening on Wednesday? We're doing Friendsgiving. Everyone has to bring a date who comes, and we have like 10 guests coming. Is she going to be there? She's going to be there. She has to bring a date, not to bring a date. Whoa, what? Yeah. <laughs> what the f? Yeah. <sighs> Who's your date? I don't have. I don't have. I have a couple yet. options. I'm still trying to like. I don't decide. have one yet. I haven't made that. So you're going to bring someone else? Yes. You guys are f- crazy, man. I don't know <laughs> what the f you guys are doing. <laughs> I still think you got a year and I still think it's, you guys are going to be good in like two months. I think we're trying to like figure out how to like be cordial and make it work. So that's where like, I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. Dude, this is funny. It's funny because it's like real. <laughs> yeah, that is. <laughs> that's why it's so entertaining. It, that's, to me. But that's why it like f- with your head because you're like. Yeah. Do you, Wait, you're not actually bringing a date. The lines get blurred, but between like the content and what's real, like that's why we like chill down and doing all of it, and it's just you know I don't know. Well, I'll be there Wednesday, so I'm okay. excited. It's gonna be, and uh, yeah, thank you guys for coming on. Of thank course. you for having sharing us. your fucking, your heart for real. Yeah, listen, <laughs> and your problems. Thanks. It was beautiful. Wow, we love you, so Brad. So much fun. Yeah. <laughs> Till next time.
Yeah. Two months. 